Mr. Matsuoka, please proceed. Yes, aloha, Chair Anderson and the uh, committee. For the record, my name is H. Doug Matsuoka, the Hawaii Gorilla Video Hui. I uh, strongly oppose the mayor's uh, criminalization bills being considered <coughs> today, namely bills 42, 43, 45, 46, and 48, I believe. I submitted a uh, written testimony, which I won't repeat, other than to note that I have uh, video documentation of the midnight raids on the homeless, which includes footage of Ross Sasamura and Jun Yang, okay? And those were done under Bill 7 or ROH 13-8, as it's known now. Um, I do want to bring up a couple of points that the mayor knows and that you know and that I know, but that the public might not know. And one is uh, the mayor knows that the bills are not about criminal behavior. They're about how much justice you can afford. Subparagraph B8 of the sit-lie bills allow you to sit in line, camp out overnight if you're there to buy the new iPhone. Okay, if you're not there to buy the new iPhone, you can't do it. Specifically, it exempts those waiting for goods and services. You'd think that if you're waiting for affordable housing, that would qualify you. I'm sure the police wouldn't cut you any slack on that. So if you can't afford the new iPhone, you can't afford justice. It's a, it's a, it's a price a lot of people can't pay. Two, the mayor knows that the laws won't clear the sidewalks because bad policy, and that's previous bad policy, and and current bad public, uh, public policy has created a potentially inexhaustible supply of homeless people. L let me read something, okay, this is a quote. Right now we have a big long waiting list in public housing, a huge waiting list in the affordable housing developments, and there's really nothing between those affordable housing rentals and the market the difference is so great that we see these huge wait lists in our public housing of 10 years. 10,000 people on the wait list. We have hundreds and thousands of people on our other private developer wait list. Those aren't my words, those are the words of Jun Yang, okay? And that's at 10 minutes, 20 seconds on the Civil Cafe um, uh, panel that he was on. That's up on YouTube, you can catch it. Okay, now we have to remember that it's homelessness that's the problem, not the homeless. So the solution has, has gone beyond the homelessness, it's, and it's really simple. We have to produce public policy that uses public assets for the public good and not for private profit. Okay, now can the current council produce such policy? You know, that's an open question for people interested in governance in candidates and elections and that sort of thing. Mr. Matsuoka, please summarize okay, and I know, conclude your testimony. To summarize, I know that uh, people are thinking, and you're aware that the electorate knows that the homeless problem has gone beyond how we treat the homeless. It's about affordable housing, as someone has mentioned before. Um, so I'm asking you to do the right thing. Reject the mayor's bills criminalizing homelessness and start working on arresting homelessness. I mean. Stop the criminalization of the homeless, but start working on arresting homelessness. Thank you. Thank you. Any Members, any questions, questions for Mr. Masso? Thank you very much.